Hi guys, welcome back. So, Babel and Luxie. Babel, I got a new light. Do you like it? I do. So, and I, when I changed into my nighty, I picked something that I don't usually wear. Just for you guys, because I know I was doing this video. And, yoga. Oh my god. So I did some beginner's yoga tonight. My daughter had to work late, so we couldn't get to the gym with enough time to work out before it closed. So we just stayed home and did a yoga thingy. I'm still breathing heavy from it. Uh, oh, I've had this yoga video for like two months, and I never opened it. I don't know why. Probably because I enjoy the pool much, much more. But the thought of yoga, I thought it was just too easy. It wouldn't be a really good workout because it's just stretching, right? <laughs> no. I did 20 minutes. I'm exhausted. 20 minutes. And I am, I'm going to say it one more time just so you all hear me. 20 minutes and I am exhausted. <sighs> okay. So, now, on to the look seat. Oh my gosh. Okay. So we're going to talk about the packaging first. She uses these eco and close packages. I have torn off the label in preparation for reuse, but these are wonderful. I love poly mailers. It keeps things safer than paper envelopes, but I like the fact that this is made from 100% recycled materials and they perforate it so that you can tear it open easily and then they put another sticky in here so that you can re reuse this envelope. Of course you can reuse it as many times as you want, you just have to tape it closed. If you get poly mailers, please reuse them. I do not, personally, I do not mind if you send me something in a reused poly mailer. I don't mind at all. So. FYI to any makers who I may order from that actually watch my videos, which is, you know, probably not happening, but I like to think you are. So I ordered this off of Etsy, sorry, from Cozy Folk. Her name is Jen, and she has the most beautiful smile. I always look at people's pictures on Etsy, so put a picture of yourself, because I like to see you. And this Jen woman, her smile is so pretty. So... I ordered a pad, obviously, and she sent along wearing instructions, which is actually pretty helpful if you don't know which way to wear your pad. It's happened to me, and I've been wearing pads for 30 plus years, so helpful, especially if you're new and you're not sure which way to wear a dispo or a, dispo a reusable pad. This is helpful. She tells you just wear the print side up for her pad in particular. And then she gives you some basic hair instructions. How to wash it, wash on cold, uh, tumble dry, low, do not bleach, iron or use fabric softeners. And this I got because they are ladybugs, rock on, and ladybugs are supposed to be lucky. So I'm thinking that I won't leak off of this because I'm supposed to be lucky, right? So I'm not going to measure it for you because I've done it like... 50 times I've been recording, trying to record for an hour and a half now. So from this end right here to the bottom is 12 inches. But I don't really care about that part because this is just backing. It doesn't absorb nothing. The absorbent part is 10 and a half inches. It, at its widest point, oh I did forget that measurement. At its widest point up at the top is three and a quarter, three and two 3.25, three, three and a quarter inches, inches, inches. <laughs> no one. I, I don't know who did that video, but there's like, I watch Brie and Alice and then I say inches. Who said that? Oh, I laughed for 20 minutes about that. So three and a quarter at its widest point. The middle of the gusset, the middle of the core, also known as the gusset, is two and a half. And this pad actually snaps up right up to that gusset, I'll show you here, which I absolutely love. 
So I'm hoping this pad works for me because I'm in love with it already. I'm just worried that I'm going to leak off the side here. And I wish her core went for closer to the edges. But you don't really know these things until you get it in your hot little hands and check it out. I'm still going to try. It's, I'm sure it's it will work for me for my stress incontinence. So I'm not worried about that. But I really want to wear this during my period. I think it's beautiful. It is marked with an M on the snap for moderate. This was 12, 12 US dollars. I want to know how she gets it so the fleece doesn't fold over either. I cut mine out and it just curls up on itself. I don't know how they get this like this. And I don't know if she surges it or what, but if she does, that is some tight surging. I see no pad underneath these stitches where it goes over the edge. This is beautifully, beautifully, beautifully made. I love this pad. I, I, oh, I just, I really hope I can wear it during my period and not have to worry about leakage. Like I said, I am a very, not only am I a front bleeder, which is kind of rare if you go by what is available in shops, but I also bleed to the extreme left. So I am seriously worried I'm going to bleed right here and leak off. So we'll see. It was 12 US dollars shipping from Oregon to Iowa was $2.50. I'm sure that goes up with more pads as the weight gets heavier. This pad is topped with a ladybug cotton flannel. It's absorbent bamboo viscous core inside and leak resistant, not proof, resistant. You guys need to know the difference. Leak proof means it will not leak whatsoever. Leak resistant means you've got a little extra time before you leak through it. It will leak if you use it to, if you overuse it. Uh, poly resin snaps, of course. And a breathable Polartec vegan fleece backing. She also has sets. These come $12 each. Let me look, since I'm on her store anyway, I'll link the store down below. That's a really bright light. And they even have a diffuser on it. Tissue paper. So, she has cloth pad starter sets. Three, five. The five dollar sets are wow. Anywhere from five dollar sets a set of five pads starts at $37 that I can see all the way up to 63 for five. I guess it really depends on the length you're getting, but I will link that down below and uh, you can check out her shop and see if she has something for you. I'm really excited to use this. The stitching is absolutely amazing. I would think that she was a factory. I don't see any flaws. I love flaws. Like little flaws, not glaring. I can't believe they sold this flaws, but I like to know it's handmade. She's phenomenal. If she does this by hand instead of a machine, like a factory machine, assembly line type thing, it's amazing. Wow. One day, I hope mine will look like this. So, those are my first impressions. I will use it. My period's coming soon. And then I will do a review if I use it enough. Uh, I need to use it my entire period. And then maybe another month to get a really good... I don't like telling you, oh, it's great, if I haven't really tested it out. We are going on 10 minutes. Holy cow. I need to give a shout out to Kayla and to Blueberry Patch. Miss Patch, you need to tell me your real name because every time I watch your video, I call you Miss Patch and I'm pretty sure that's not your name. So thank you for saying hello to me and talking about my channel. I really appreciate that. And as always, have a wonderful day. Bye.